young nigga under the sun She smacking me out cause I'm the motherfucking done They don't want smoke with the phone I piss with before you know I'm That's a hellhole back hey, Fucking that bitch up back break That free jazz Y'all see It's your boy and man Lenny We is back with another mother loving YouTube Why wow, hit you in your What's up y'all it's your boy Mad45. When I say Mad45, you know that NGB come with. And if you ain't mad, then you ain't lit. Cause you gotta be lit to be mad then. So that mean you gotta be mad to be lit then. Black! If you gotta do anything else, make sure you go ahead and like, subscribe, and go ahead and comment. And go ahead and share it to your family the way your fam at for real and your mom. Thank God for me still be able to live to this day to still be made my YouTube videos, still have the passion, still keep having the drive on making youtube videos the confidence everything i just love it so much i'm still be able to live to this day a black young male in america it's hard and i'm glad to say i'm still here living and still be able to praise to towards them yes. amen today's video is how 2024 how i'm trying to prepare 2024 and what i should what i'm trying to expect in 2024 and stuff all the plans all the goals all all the stuff that's already already in process already in 2023 and moving forward into 2024 and how i want things to go and flow so that was today's video is we're gonna start off with the clothing brand i had so many people ask me questions malik what's up with fish your spirit on um, my new clothing brand called head hunting some of y'all asked me that malik what's up with head hunting like boom boom i want to say i'm gonna i'm gonna wait i'm gonna wait to explain fish your spirit because fish your spirit it's a little more detailed so i'm gonna wait into that but we're gonna get a head hunt Hey Hunt is my new clothing brand. I already got the designs for it, everything. Me personally, I made my own graphic designs, all that. In the process now, I have finally found me a manufacturer that's affordable and to be able to give me my right type of product I want and stuff. Instead of, I'm sending this money and I'm getting the wrong product. I don't want that because I don't want to waste time and money. And I want to I don't want to waste y'all time and money how I did fix your spirit and stuff. So. Fish and Spirit, I ain't waste no money. Y'all money, really me making decisions, but it took a long time, but we're gonna get to that. I came about it, headhunting, it was during the football season when I was like, I'm headhunting and stuff. Then now I started like, all right, cool. Let me, let me make a clothing brand out of it, but let me make something special with it. So I got a meaning to it. In a whole nother video, I'm explaining what headhunting is and stuff, a little, little more detail about my clothing brands and how it gonna go and stuff. But I went pretty much, then you got Fish Your Spirit. People like, what's up, Fish Your Spirit? Fish Your Spirit is wonderful, beautiful. For Fish Your Spirit, I already got my LLC for it. I got the EIN number. So Fish Your Spirit, I got everything for it. Cool. And stuff. Um, thing is, I don't have a design for it. Like, the phrase itself, Fish, Fish Your Spirit, is immaculate. Wonderful. The thing is, I don't have a design for it. And the problem is, I don't want that phrase to be so amazing that when people look at design, I don't want people to look at design like, oh, it's just a plain, it's catchy, but it's plain. It don't really got to, wow, I got to get this on some stuff. And I know I can come up with design like crazy, and I know I got a couple stuff in my head, but to just put it out and stuff is more difficult than when you really try to think of it. But I'm, tr I'm trying to do Fish Your Spirit the graphic design on my own and stuff so I can be proud of myself. But if it do have to come out where I have to give me a graphic designer to come with, but I still have to think of how I want it and stuff. So if I can be able to think of the right gra graphic, the right picture for official Spirit, I know how to do all the graphic stuff myself. I really self-taught myself how to do it. All you gotta do is pay for the software to do it for the top-notch upgrade software. All you do is have to pay for it and start learning it yourself. Cause in that case, they start doing it yearly. So you just, on average, you probably paying like $74 yearly and stuff. You talking about, you know how much worth it. So playing less than a dollar for a software I know I'm gonna use most of the time out the year, hundred dollars, that's what an investment. And you know what I'm saying? When you think of it, it's not like, oh, that's my hundred. No, you gotta think of, all right, this is for my future. This is how I wanna live. Cause a hundred dollars, I want a hundred dollars not to be nothing to me. So that's how you think and stuff, pretty much. We're gonna go from my YouTube, right? My YouTube, as y'all, some of y'all can see, no, as most of y'all can see, I've been doing a lot more skits now and stuff because I'm funny with the skits and I see it like I'm gaining more followers from my skits and everything. So I'm, for Instagram wise and stuff, I'm really pushing my, towards my skits towards Instagram so I can get some more, gain more followers. Cause I've been, I, out of every skit, I gain at least five, five to 10 
followers and stuff. So I can keep that up. Skits gonna keep going up. I just gotta be more creative with my skits and stuff and have the balls and take the risk. Not I'm not gonna do OD dumb stuff, but I'm not gonna do no plain corny skit. They be like, all right, we know this kid is a skit. It's, it's corny and stuff. No, I wanna be like, damn, this nigga bleep funny. Like, oh, some stuff. You know what I'm saying? Real, real stuff that will literally have people come be like, all right, yeah, this nigga really doing it. And so, so my skits really come, go towards TikTok. I had, I had one skit I post, I was gonna reach a thousand views. And it's not even YouTube shorts. It was like I posted and somehow it went to like my regular YouTube, a regular YouTube video instead of a YouTube short. And I also got to a thousand views. I'm not gonna stop posting my skits. I'm gonna keep doing it because I still keep thinking of skits every day. I got about, today I thought of like seven skits I can do and I wrote them down so, so I can already have these going and flowing. So, of course my YouTube though, for posting the videos, I won't say I've been slacking. For as far as y'all know, for the people who really hear from me and stuff, as I'm gonna let y'all know, um, it was like two or three months back, I got sick, I had lost my job, and the whip had broke down. I was like, what I'm gonna do? I felt like I was in a hole. I'm expecting, I'm like, all right, cool, I'm gonna be back out in the maximum two weeks. You know what God told me? He said, you need to sit down and rest because when you was outside, you was in a loop so much, you didn't know what to do and stuff. So what are we gonna do? You're gonna take them for sacrifice. You're gonna take them risks and stuff. Can you think every, in certain words I used to say, I'm like, nah, I'm never gonna do this. I'm never gonna do that. What God did. All right, since you were saying like, you're not gonna never do this. Now you need to learn how to, to adapt to this life and stuff instead of feeling like, oh, you can't have everything so quick and stuff. Cool. So. I took my time, really slow down with everything, social media wise, and just even popping out with the YouTube events and stuff. So I was like, I need to really focus on myself individually instead of go, 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 and stuff. It wasn't working. It wasn't working as much as I thought it was and stuff. So I'm glad I took the reset. It really was a reset for me because now this reset really taught me a lot of things and now I increased so I'm not even gonna tell y'all how much blessings that really come about that's going on with my future and really see who my friend, no, see who's my family for real. Nah, that's dumb. Me personally, um, going into 2024, how my, show my goals and stuff, I'm gonna share with y'all. Clothe the brand I told you about with YouTube, which I meet individually. I say, um, get back in the gym consistently. Not saying I'm getting fat or anything, like I'm still, I'm still fit and everything, you know what I'm saying? I feel like I, I just want to gain more pounds, build my shoulders back up again, eat more, eat more healthy, then get big, get big, get bigger and stuff, get more bulkier and all that. Going to college, I'm going to college. The plan was to go to angle camp. I've been, I've been BSing for like August to September. I was talking about no, this September, I was talking about going to college. I had so much time. I was BS and I let my personal life got in, interfere with what I was really, the main focus was. Because the problem was, if I would have went to college after high school, I would have been straight. All the, I let the summer got to me. I let the hype of the summer got to me, not knowing, not realizing if I was still in college, I would have had 10 times more fun in that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not leaving Georgia. I'm going to, Georgia. I will go to Georgia State or GZC and stuff, still be around the same environment even more because I would know more people. You know what I'm saying? So, I regret that God have his reasons for why certain stuff happened. And the reason why I feel like that because God had to show me who's there, how, hey man, it's a lot of stuff that went on it had shut my mind. So it's like, all right, cool. Now I got to come up about stuff different. I is and um so the plan is in February I'm gonna go to the GGC go there for a year then I'm gonna transfer to Georgia State we cool with and as we in college we're gonna get our studies in audio and film engineering all that because I'm good with my hands but I just fix a whole motor mount like I've been fixing motor mounts and stuff all that like self-taught off like YouTube type stuff like I've been doing this self-taught and stuff shout out little man I'm long and stuff. Mm. I'm saying for the people who know Milan, who is Little Mag, Milan, Little Mag is my sister. 
how she got, she got the same initials, so our first, middle, and last name make Mag and stuff, so that's why I call him Little Mag, my twin, for real. Um, get Milan on social media. Milan Ben has social media, but for all the people who don't know, Milan the one who gonna make y'all his social media stuff. It's her, it's her. All the dances, anything, it's her. I really, before I was like, all right, I wanna blow up first and stuff, but as I like get older, I started really like, all right, now, not saying I, I, I still won't blow up. I'm still young. I'm still young as hell. Like, in my mind, I still keep forgetting, like, bro, I'm young as hell. And you know what people tell me? Like, bro, you so much on trying to get it now and make it at 19, bro. Not realizing, bro, I ain't made it till I was like 22, 23. And I'm just like, bro, I still got to get it. So from long, bro, as I work on my path, I'm going to keep pouring more and more to it. Much I learned keep going to her so when she blow hey i already know how this junk go 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 don't do it do this i already tell her now keep her head straight and get out and do it got the way because i'm like if you learn that now to who's real and fake and everything when we when we make it you won't it won't be no hesitations to cut people off because we don't got time for the bullshit put some shit, shit how 2023 was shit was up and downs Thank you, shit, about to be smooth as fuck. When I say in the beginning of 2023, I said 2023 gonna be a learning year. And was it? What? I'm thinking the learning year about to be a good learning year. Not saying it was bad learning, but it's like, damn, y'all niggas. Y'all niggas, y'all niggas, y'all niggas, bro. It's so much shit that happened, shows me, has showed me like, couldn't cry about it no more. Couldn't be heartbroken about it no more. It showed me so much shit. It was like, hey, this ain't gonna stop me. You know what I'm saying? I had to show me it ain't gonna stop me. I gotta keep going. Like, why well, I'm make somebody other somebody? Why well, I'm gonna let somebody who don't have the same vision or same goals as me stop me? I'm me. I'm mad lit. I'm a leak. I gotta make it. If I don't, I'm fucked up. <laughs> hey, bro. I just thank God, bro, for this. It's me here. It's with me, man. I ain't did no suicide, none of that. I'm still living. I'm in no hospital bed, none of that. 2024, I'm coming for everything. 2024, I'm coming for everything. Let that be known. 2024, I'm coming for everything. What I mean, I'm coming for everything. I'm coming for everything. 2024, I'm coming for everything. I learned a lot of stuff. I learned how a lot of stuff will work. When I come for everything, I'm going full 100% force. Ain't no emotional behind it. None is strictly business, strictly truth, strictly I have faith in it. No turn it, no slightly turn it back. I'm straight head forward, straight. That's how I'm coming. And you can accept how I'm be how I'm gonna be. Go ahead. I understand. I understand. Go ahead. You go ahead. I ain't my family bag or nothing. Go ahead, bro. Go ahead have your life. But when I tell you, when I tell you, you stick by me, stay by me until I make it. Not even until I make it, still make it. I got you. And certain people witness it. It's 10 toes with this. Because I'm going to be 10 toes about you. So it's 10 toes with this. You're not 10 toes. Go ahead, man. man. Do your thing. But that's today's video. Um, appreciate for all the people who watch, all the vi watch through the video, watch my old video, and watch. From day one when I first started dropping. So I love y'all. Do y'all thing. Stay lit out here. You know what I'm saying? Keep your boy mad lit. Don't let nobody put you down, bro. Family, friends, no matter what, bro. It's you. Do you. Do what's best, you know. You don't got to be nobody else. Don't try to please nobody else. Do what you know. God bless you. God love you. I love you. Keep doing what you do. And be great in life. It's your boy, Mad 45 HGB, a.k.a. If you ain't mad, you ain't mad.